Hi everybody, Rob Keys here doing another edition of What's in the Box. For this unboxing video, uh, it's actually more of a confession. And it's, this, is, uh, this is tough for me to say uh, on camera. I'm recording this with a, an iPhone 7 that I got before I went traveling a month ago. Um, and and I'm thinking about this a lot today, but I, I have to admit it. I have to get it out there. Uh, going forward, I am um, I'm a Mac user. Let me show you. This is my MacBook Pro 13. This is the uh, one that just came out last month. Um, it's like my main work laptop. I still have my Lenovo uh, Yoga, which has been amazing. It's four years old and it's, <laughs> it feels to me just as good as this, but this is a lot slimmer. Uh, look how thin this bad boy is. Um, this one took a while to order. It took five or six weeks to come in because we, uh, well, first of all, it's the MacBook Pro and they were selling like hot cakes. This is the new uh, touchpad feature that they were promoting, which I think is more of a gimmick. The, literally the only thing I use it for is to press escape and to use the volume. I haven't used it for any of the apps. I wish there were a regular escape button. I wish there were regular function keys. Um, this is cool though. It does do the touchpad login thing, I guess. But other than that, oh look at that. Most anticipated movies of 2017. I gotta publish that tomorrow. Um, anyway, so now I'm gonna hook this up to this 4K monitor. I got my other 4K monitor for my stuff. This is all my podcasting equipment. Just to show you how hardcore Mac I am now. Uh, check out all the uh, dongles. Oh yeah, so the other stupid thing. <laughs> With the MacBook is that there are no USB ports at all, not even an HDMI port. There's these uh, what do you call them? Thunderbolt USB Cs, two uh, on each side, and I don't know what that is. Is that a mic? There's a mic jack. That's all there is. So it's 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 hashtag dongle life. So I got this bad boy, uh, which takes um, VGA, Ethernet, uh, USB, and HDMI. I got a regular one, which is uh, another for another monitor. The mouse, which I have to charge up. This is another thing. This is just a bunch of USB ports. Uh, just another USB adapter. Uh, this is the MacBook box, which, you know, just a nice packaging. If you ever bought an iPad or an iPhone, this is standard. This is my stand. I'm going to set it up over there with the monitor. And then, of course, this is my keyboard, which I haven't even opened yet. So that'll help me because I need a full keyboard for sure with the number keys and everything. Uh, but that's not all for Boxing Day sales. Uh, look, I'm such an Apple user. Recording on an iPhone 7, got the MacBook, and I just bought myself. Um, it was super on sale. This is the new iPad Air 2. It's not that new, actually. It came out a year or two ago now. But I had the original iPad Air, which is like four years old, but it's only 16 gigabyte. Um, so I bought this bad boy with the uh, Logitech um, cover slash stand keyboard thingy. Uh, I used to have one of these with my old, old iPad 2 or 3, and it was amazing. So I got the new one to go with the iPad Air. Um, this bad boy is 128 gigabytes. It was on sale at Best Buy for like 100 bucks off or 200 bucks off or something. So I thought, you know what? I fly a lot. I read a ton of comics, but I have no space to download them and read them offline. I have no space for apps. So yeah, there you go. So MacBook, brand new iPad, a whole bunch of stuff. Recording on an iPhone 7. So yeah, that's my confession. I'm, I'm a bit of an Apple user. Um, but don't worry. Still got my custom rig. Uh, my main beast. I built this thing myself. I just put in the new GeForce uh, 1070, GTX 1070, and the 970 I had in there is going to go on my other custom desktop, which is on the other side of this wall, uh, so I have two good gaming rigs. This I'm setting up so you, I can put in this bad boy, you can't see it here, but under that box right there is an HTC Vive VR headset, which I haven't set up yet. Um, this is my uh, Xbox One. Well, everything's a mess right now in this office, but anyways, um, that's it for now. Uh, so that's my confession. <laughs> uh, I'm not a Mac user. This is my very first Mac computer, so I, I was making a bit of a joke about that. I am still uh, all about the PC mainly, but this is a very nice um, um, work laptop. Everybody at the Valnet offices uses MacBooks, 90% uh, of the people anyways. Um, so I still have my PC laptop and my desktop PCs, two of them, plus now I have the MacBook. It's important for me to learn it because a lot of my coworkers and colleagues do use MacBooks, so I, I need to learn all the different shortcuts. Literally, every freaking day I have to like Google how to use the command button versus like the control button on, on the keyboard. Everything's kind of backwards. It's a little less efficient, I find, using the command because it's not, it's beside the space bar instead of in the bottom left corner. So simple things like uh, moving between tabs or, or copying and pasting or, or bouncing around text real quickly. Everything's slower because of the thumb positioning, but whatever. I got to get used to it. The, the massive touchpad is awesome. Uh, it is very fast and sleek. Like I said, we got the maximum amount of... Um, uh, RAM, the whole thing solid state, uh, we get the best processor, processor you can get, which is why it took a long time to come in, but um, anyway, so now I'm a PC and a Mac user, sort of, uh, Mac newbie, uh, I have been a big proponent of the iPhones and iPads, and now, you know, it makes sense to get the Mac book, so all I need now is an Apple TV, and I'll have the, uh, 
the whole lineup. So um, hope you enjoyed that. Uh, I have to set up all this stuff. Maybe I'll, I'll include a little snapshot or video at the very end when it's all set up at the end of this video. Um, otherwise, like and subscribe. I hope you had a happy holidays. Let me know in the comments what you got for Christmas, and uh, we'll see you next time. Cheers.